So in this video, we're going to show you how to calibrate a character. Calibration is usually needed after years of service or if you put on a new puppet. So the first thing you got to do is get to the cylinders that we're going to calibrate. On the hand, there are two cylinders. And on each of the roosters, there are three. So the first thing we'll do is pull out the uh, pillow under its chest and we'll lift the puppet up so we can reveal the two cylinders. The cylinder that controls the mouth movement and the cylinder that controls the head up down. So now we go over to our control panel and we're going to press F3 then immediately F4. That'll get us into calibration mode. So we'll walk over and do that now. Okay, so we're in calibration mode. You hear the chickens clucking. And what we want to do, we can loosen off the lock nuts on the float control valves and the bottom valve on the mouth controls how fast it opens and the top valve controls how fast it closes. So what you want to do is just slowly play with each of those until you get all the puppets synchronized to the music and to each other. So you notice the puppet in the center here. This is what a final calibration should look like when it's all done. Now calibration mode, if you press, go and press F4 again, you will get into calibration to calibrate the head tilt up down. Press F4 again, you'll get into calibration for head tip up. Press F4 again, you'll get into calibrating for the fox left right. And the last calibration on most models is for the whole crate to lift up and down. Some models vary from year to year. For the most part, they'll step through each of the calibration modes. If you have any questions, just give us a call at Chickamation.